Hi guys, so I'm doing a review of the Nails Ink My Polish Diary. And so the great thing about this, the concept of it is that you get a nail varnish for every month of the year. Um, and so obviously you get 12 nail varnishes. Um, normally a Nails Ink nail varnish, if you've not had one before, will retail from about 12 to 15 pounds per bottle, depending on the special effect, the look of the bottle. Some of them have Diamantes and some of them don't. Um, and whether, you know, whether it's a limited edition, whether it's new, whether it's old. So about 12 to 15 pounds per bottle, which isn't the cheapest, um, but they are usually the cutest, so. Um, but yeah, I absolutely love this. I've already done a look, which I will show you here. They're sparkly red, and I've used a few of the colors to create this. Starting off in the packaging, it's super, super sparkly. Um, it is literally sparkled out all round. And on the back, it just has pictures and it explains what's inside. And then when you open it, voila, it is literally like a diary, like a book. And it has the 12 colors in there. For January, you have the caviar top coat and it just dries clear. I'm wearing this on top of here now. Um, it helps them to dry, it helps them to harden. I think you can use this as a base coat too, so an essential really for any nail varnish look. For February, you have the St. Martin's Lane, which is a berry kind of purpley color. Again, I'm wearing this as, as my base coat beneath the sparkles, and that looks like that. For March, you have the Baker Street, and this is a really, really bold blue. Um, it's really, really, really pretty, this one, and I just think this is going to stand out a mile. This is something quite different. Um, I don't really have too many colours that are this deep, rich blue. I've already used this colour too, and I know that you have to do a couple of coats, but it's well, well worth waiting for it to dry and doing another coat, because this just gives you fantastic colour payoff. This is April, and this is Sloan Avenue. I even love the names of the Nails Ink one. They're all, obviously, um, related to British uh, things, British streets, British foods etc so I absolutely love these. For May I am so excited to use this one. This is part of their cupcake sprinkles and just look at that the sticker on top shows a little pretty cupcake and all in this bottle is absolutely decked out with sparkles of different sizes, different colours and it's all in a baby pink base. This is part of their special effects range and it is called Fulham Palace Gardens. For June, we have Chester, which is um, their feather effect. Um, this has a very, very cute little bird. And all around the cap on the top, there are feathers. And the actual colour of this is kind of a mixture of oranges, yellows, greens. And it's made up of tiny little um, bits of, I don't really know what it is, but cut up metallic-y fibres, I suppose. Um, and it's called the feather effect because when you paint it on, you actually get a similar effect to what I've got on my nails. There are lots of little flecks of colour um, and this one isn't sparkly but it will just add like a really multi-dimensional effect to your nails. For July you have a new neon shade that they haven't issued before. This is Notting Hill Gate and this is Barbie Barbie pink. Really really cute, proper neon and it's going to be fantastic for the summer. For August you have Fleet Street and this is the leather effect. It's like a nudie brown, so this is quite a good option um, if you don't want to be too bold but you really want something different on your nails. This gives you like a matte, it's not a rippled effect, I've already tried this so I do know what it's like, but it's like a rough, instead of your nails drying shiny, smooth and even, it gives you like a rough textured effect and it is quite an interesting effect, especially if you're doing it on like a feature nail or all over as a manicure and it's this kind of nudie, um, neutral colour. For September you have Electric Lane. This is a holographic top coat and it's part of their special effect range. So you couldn't really wear this as a colour on its own because it is uh, very transparent but it just give you a super sparkly holographic effect and it has a holographic sticker on the top there to show that. For October you have the Belgravia Palace and this is the fiber optic range. It's red, it's gold, it's even silver, just all flecks of different colors and it's just really, really sparkly. It shows you fiber optic sticker there. For November you have the South Kensington Nails Foil and this is really just a smooth, smooth, buttery silver color. And I've used this one. This does absolutely give you the effect of wrapped foil. Um, I know that the foils that you put on your nails and you don't obviously paint them, you actually stick them on, have become very popular and it really does give you a very similar effect to that. This one, you only need one coat um, and it's very effective, very quick. If you're just running out of time to do your nails, absolutely. Um, South Kensington foil effect will give you that just 
just painted and professional looking um, smooth finish in one coat. And finally in December you have Knightsbridge Road. This is absolutely amazing. I haven't actually seen a nail varnish like this and I do like my polish. Just sparkly gold base but it has big pink sparkles, um, green, purple, silver there's literally every sparkle in this one and it's just like a fireworks gone off in the bottle it is amazingly pretty so thanks for watching and as always if you've got any questions don't hesitate to contact me and subscribe to my channel follow me on twitter and i'll see you soon all right bye